Hey, this is Jeff with Complete Medical Services. I wanted to do a quick walkthrough of the new Mindray TE5 uh, MSK ultrasound, fully touch screen. It's got a lot of great features, uh, one being the table stand. So it has an option for a cart, it has an option for a wall mount, and it has an option for this great uh, table stand. So if we rotate uh, to the back side of the system, what we'll see over here are the various port connectors. So there's four USB uh, ports, there's an HDMI, there's a network, and there's also a VGA. So obviously, if you wanna do an external monitor out using the HDMI is really uh, the best option to add an external monitor. And many times we'll actually add uh, an external monitor uh, in order to have extra viewing area, especially for the, the patient as they're watching the scanning, it's nice for them to see uh, the image and their scan up on an external monitor. So one feature here is the very fast boot up time. And that seems to be a very common feature with the MindRay platforms. <clears throat> Quick boot up, uh, it's got a, a nice uh, backup battery with it. Um, viewing area of the TE5 is really nice and from a tactile perspective, um, it's very, very responsive. So this could be great in a point of care environment. However, there's two versions. There's the TE5 and there's the TE7. The TE5 is really geared for MSK um, and designed for MSK. This has a number of unique features, uh, which we'll go over on the second video, which really has to do with the e-spatial navi. Uh, the e-spatial navi is actually a magnetic needle uh, finder, which is very, very unique. The probe that I have with it right now, which is the L11-3VNS, is uh, the probe that works with the magnetic needle finding technology. So with the needle finding technology, really it doesn't matter if you're in a deeper structure where your uh, visibility and view of a typical needle might be more difficult, uh, with the magnetic needle finder, you're actually able to visualize the location of the needle and it gives you a roadmap uh, to show you how to get to the needle, which is pretty impressive. So we're going to go through uh, that in the next video. Um, however, now just to kind of do a quick walkthrough and again, the buttonology and the ease of use of the system. So we can go into uh, um, the different... Uh, 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 functionalities here we have um, eye station which is where we're going to have uh, stored images you know so we can easily pull up any of the stored image files uh, that would be on the system so here uh, we have a few uh, stored images that were that were in here and you can see they're they're nicely laid out uh, they're easily accessible uh, to get to the images um, and really moving from uh, image uh, to image uh, is really easy so um, in this area as well, uh, we have our measurement. Um, so if we're going to take an image, uh, you can easily pull up the, the measurement, the caliper, um, and you can move the, the calipers very, very readily. Um, there's no issue with moving caliper from measurement uh, perspective. Um, you can do real small movements with, with the, uh, for, for measurements, and it just makes it really, really nice uh, to, be able to, to be able to use. Um, saving the image, saving the clip. We can go from B mode uh, to color, to power Doppler, to M mode, to pulse wave. We have a lot of nice uh, functionality uh, that's automatically built in. Um, over here, from a workflow perspective, very similar to the other MindRay systems, where we can go from uh, patient uh, input uh, entry to uh, probe. On the probe uh, selection, you get to select the probe as well as the preset that you're planning on working with the probe. So we hear thyroid, vascular, carotid. This can be configured to only show those, uh, those uh, specific uh, presets that you're gonna be working with. So if we wanna go to MSK, now it's set up for MSK use. If we wanted to go to superficial, uh, we can go to superficial, nerve, uh, whatever it might be. Um, and then you're ready to scan. Um, you have a number of uh, easy to use. Again, eye touch is an auto optimization feature. Eye needle, which is the needle visualization. Um, and then those systems that come equipped with the e-spatial navi have the e-spatial navi, which is the magnetic needle finder. So 
That is the TE5, just a real brief walkthrough. Thought I would uh, share and show it off. All right, thank you.